we were going to drop about 3,000 ping pong balls from the ceiling of Woods Hall. All right, here goes trial number one of today. Ready? Yeah. Trial one was successful. Trial number two. Actually, we're done. With some ping pong balls. I think that's enough weight. Okay. Very good. Test two, sadly, was not a success yet. But the I have hope. Skewer successfully came out, but Ping pong balls did not. Trial three. Trial three. To the music Blondie. No. The music Rapture. The music Rapture by the artist Blondie. She was 1980s. Chad's choice. Did you see that? Oh shoot, I didn't see it. Well. You see the evidence. Clearly, trial three was a success. Woo! Pre-paint stirring. Post-paint stirring. The um, baby carriage box is being transformed. This is what our fellow peers will see when they glance up into the hole in the ceiling Monday morning. This is probably yep, this is Chad and I's lunch right here. Six dollars and fifty four cents for this cute little guy. And since it was a lunch special, we got a free water. We are trying to install the machine into the ceiling. This is probably the most difficult task we have faced throughout this process. Yeah, this is what people are going to see. Um, the day of. The day of. It does look slightly suspicious, however, they no, don't know what's going to hit them. Literally. Literally. <laughs> what was that, Chad? Now, this is incredibly dangerous. We're very dedicated to our physics. We are um, incredibly dedicated to we physics. We sacrifice ourselves in the name of success. Uh, hello there. This is the attic. You probably can't see anything in here. But for the record, that right there is the Thunder Rumbler. Uh, uh, yeah. It's on its little uh, stand made out of Legos because I do love Legos. And that right there is the, the uh, string which connects the Thunder Rumbler to the pin. And then that is the wheel well which connects the uh, string to the actual Thunder Rumbler motor. So all together, whenever we press forwards on our Thunder Rumbler remote, it will uh, create tension which removes the pin and opens the flood. Kathleen is now loading from the mischievous hat into the box itself. Can we have a drum roll, please? I don't know, but let's see. Because this, Might folks, be this is the moment of truth for the meantime. Chad is. Okay, hold on. Here we go. Are you ready? Let's do a countdown. Five. Four. Three. three two, two. One. one. Oh. Oh. Close, but no cigar.
Okay, that's that's pretty good. Yeah. Kathleen is currently loading <laughs> our nefarious device with ammunition. Uh, or trying. Attempting to see the better verb choice. Oh yeah. See that? Trying to conceal the evidence. Hello? Chad Ryden's here? Outside. Dreadful, dreadful. What dreadful time is it, Chad? Let's uh let's check the old phone. Kathleen? I believe it's three o'clock. Yeah. I'm um What time did we arrive? Eleven? We, we arrived around eleven. 11.15 for me. Four hours later. Four hours later. What is he doing? He's, um... What's that? Jack! You have to be aggressive. Yeah, you gotta they still do that. Go after it. Right? <laughs> Don't talk to anybody. Just go.